Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Jenny and today I have a Dollar Tree haul to share with you. Everything I picked up is brand new. I'm also going to be adding a Q&A at the end. I will be doing a video as well trying out a bunch of these products for you. I started to do a, a tryout video months ago with my kids and I just never got around editing it so I'll probably end up doing that one first and then I'm going to be trying out a bunch of these new products that are hitting the shelves at the Dollar Tree. So let's go ahead and dive in and let's see what I chose for this haul. Okay, let's start out with this. How about some Himalayan pink salt bath salt? 100% naturally pure, up to 84 plus minerals. A one pound bag. Yes, look at that. One pound bag of Himalayan pink salt for your body. So it says here, add a couple spoonfuls to warm water in the bathtub. You will experience how fresh and smooth your body feels. Do not towel dry. Instead, gently pat your skin and allow it air dry. Like a dog. How my, how my Himalayan pink bath salt benefit? Soften and heal cracked skin, reduces swelling, get rid of dead skin, relax body, cleanses while it eliminates odor. Interesting. So yes, 100% pure. Do you have a pull tab on you? You probably don't. I didn't just now notice that. It looks like it's in a jar. Huh. Just now notice that. We'll get you. Sooner or later, we will get you. We will not get you. Let me go get some scissors. Okay, I got it open. It has a resealable bag, but I could not get it open, so I just cut it off. So this is what it looks like and it has absolutely no smell. All I can smell is the plastic bag. So I don't know how that's supposed to eliminate odor. I don't know. Maybe it absorbs. Well, let's just touch you. Let's touch you. Doesn't have any scent whatsoever. So I'll probably try it out on my feet since I don't take baths. Okay, moving on. How about some sugar coffee body scrub? smell like coffee? Here you go. This is sugar coffee body scrub. Don't even think about it until I've had my coffee scrub. 1.7 ounce bottle. Directions apply when bathing. Use circular motion on body. Avoid your face and other delicate areas. So let's, oh it doesn't have a seal. Ooh. Wow, that, my friends, really, oh, it's got plastic. I was like, it's stale. Take the plastic off. <laughs> wow, you take the plastic off and wow, you get hit with some strong aroma. It looks like tree sap. Ooh, ooh. Interesting. Oh, looks like a big booger. Let's, I don't know if I want to put this all over my body. I mean, would you want to smell like a cup of coffee? Isn't that what your breath's for? So it is clumpy, of course. <laughs> I came prepared. I came with my paper towels, but no scissors. So we fix that. So it is exfoliating. I smell like a coffee shop. I smell like Starbucks, which isn't a bad thing. It leaves your skin shiny. So I think maybe after you rinse it with water, but it is smooth. Huh, I'm gonna have to try that. Oh, I'm sorry, I just, oh wait, what did I do with you? Here you go. I just, I mean, it doesn't smell bad, but I don't think I want my whole body smelling like that. I think that'd be something good to put on my feet. I think I would use that on my feet. Everything goes on my feet. I don't know why. I just dropped you. On my rug. Okay, how about this? How about some Ultimate White Teeth Whitening Powder? You now it says infused with activated coconut charcoal, fluoride free, natural whitener, non GMO, no harmful bleach or gel. This is a 
five ounce jar. Now this was over by the toothpaste and it feels like there's like absolutely nothing in it. So it has a little pull tab here. So we are going to open this together. <laughs> I open it up. I'm like, oh my God, there's nothing in there. There is something in there and it has no scent. It just looks like soot. Wow. It has like no weight to it whatsoever. It looks like it's just, you know, like when you have a fire pit and the burn, what is it? Char not charcoal, ash. I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Hmm. So you put that on your teeth, huh? Why do I have to smell everything? I don't know. Wow. I hope it doesn't make your uh, teeth look like that. But I know a lot of you said charcoal is not good for your teeth. Oh, great. Now I got a big black spot on my hand along with oil and coffee. Can't get it off my finger. I literally cannot get it off my finger. I got it off the back of my hand, but not my finger. So I will have to try that out just to show you what it does and looks like. So I will put that in the tryout file. Oh, I forgot to put your little lid on there. I'm sorry, little buddy. You're probably getting chilly in here, aren't you? Let's put your little cap on there so you don't go spilling everywhere. Okay, moving on. This is right next to that. This is the Brush Buddies, which I bought the toothbrush last week of that brand. And it's a bamboo toothbrush. This is a uh, herbal tooth, herbal, herbal toothpaste infused with activated charcoal. Naturally whitens. Hmm. Fluoride free, dye free, cool mint. And this is a 4.2 ounce uh, bottle. Tube. Spit it out. So this is a good size thing of toothpaste. So let's see what you smell like and look like. And we can't because you have a seal. Which is a good thing. Ooh, looks gummy. Okay. Very minty. And it is black. So we're just going to rub everything on my hand today. So it really does smell minty. Very sticky, just like toothpaste is supposed to be. So I will have to try that as well. So it does smell good, but I'm just kind of afraid to use it because a lot of you said uh, charcoal is not good for your teeth. But for the sake of the video and maybe those out there that like to use it, I will try it out and see what happens. See if another tooth will fall out or break. Okay, they had this. Um, it's by Golden Leaf. This is aloe vera and vitamin E softer and smoother skin body cream. 10 snip off capsules. I don't think I've ever read that on a bottle before. Now the other bottle they had was a pill that you take to help strengthen your nails. I do not want to open this because I bought this for a friend. So I'm not going to tear it open, but you can hear that, um, well, I don't think she's going to mind. I don't think she'll mind. So I'm going to pop this Oh my goodness gracious, was not expecting to see that. Looks like a little bomb or a little, oh, it's a little um, bowling pin. That's what it looks like. It's kind of mushy and it's silver. Interesting. I've never seen a pill like that before. Or not a pill, but a little thingy to do. So you get 10 of those. So that's cool. Sorry that I opened your bottle, but I don't think she'll care. So that is great. I might have to go back and get myself one and just try it out. Because it says it's good for, um, what did I read on here? It's like good for your legs and, well, it says snipper, use scissors to cut tip, apply to the, to the skin as much as needed, use daily for best results, ideal for legs, arms, face, body, sunburns, and scars. So this was, of course, over by the vitamins and everything like that. Okay, so I had my little man with me on this trip, and he goes, Mom, look at this. Can I get it? So I'm like, okay, this. This is a finger game hockey. Very cool. So I'm going to open it up, and we're going to see 
if it really works. Will it? Is it plastic? With a plastic ball? Two, I should say. So I guess you probably just play with the one. And this is going to be hard to show you because I'm going to have to do it in an angle. Well, let's do the flippers. Come on, flip. Oh, crap. I don't think it's supposed to. Okay. Might keep them entertained for about 30 seconds. But he wanted it, so he was a good boy. And he always finds money. Every store we go to, he finds a dime, finds a quarter, he finds a dollar. Ugh, he's gonna win the lottery one day. So yes, there is that. Just a few more things. So last week I hauled some of these, or was it the week before? I think it was last week or the week before. I hauled the smaller Hershey glasses and they came in a pack of four. Well, this is almost double the size. I don't know. I don't think I have. I have one of the glasses over there. I'll have to compare. But this says Hershey's Syrup Genuine Chocolate Flavors. And it has the stamp and the barcode. Like I said, always make sure the item you are buying has a barcode. Because if it doesn't have a barcode, they separated it from a case and they shouldn't. So always be sure there's a barcode on the item you are buying at the Dollar Tree. But this is an amazing glass. So let me go over here and get the other glass so we can compare sizes. So just a minute. Okay, so I brought the case that I had hauled. So this came in a pack of four and there's no barcode on there. So I'm going to show you the difference. I mean, the width is so so much bigger and this thing is heavy these are amazing glasses for only a dollar and i only seen this at one of my dollar trees and that one was located in kendallville indiana and that's about a 40 minute drive for me i really didn't find a whole lot at that store but this is one item that i did find that i never seen at any other dollar tree okay how about some car fresheners? These are by Armorall, which is a name brand. And this one is Island Oasis Vent Sticks. So I love how they have the scratch and sniff stickers right here. It smells really good. All you do is clip it onto your um, vent. Now, if you don't wanna use it in your car, you don't have to. You could put it in your bathroom. You can um, clip it um, maybe in your kitchen um on on a cord meh probably not a cord i'm thinking well we're doing it on that but yeah i'm sure you can clip it anywhere in your house if you want so just because it says it's for the car doesn't mean you have to use it for the car okay i don't know if my phone's blurry or not i don't know if it's zooming in and out it's hard to tell so i don't know we'll see i guess i'll see once i'm done recording how it turns out okay a couple of more a couple more items that I picked up in the food department is this Betty Crocker, um, I don't know, some toppers and four cutters included. Bold colors, purple, yellow, and pink. Simple decorations. Uh, three to four ounce tubes of the icing stuff. So it has, there is the front, the side, the back, and the cutters. So... Let me get my handy dandy uh, scissors here and we are going to open it up to show you what you get. Ooh, those are big. So you get three of the icing thingies, I assume. And then you get the four cookie cutters, which you'll just break apart, you know, rip those plastic things off and then you have the cutter so you get four of those so that is really cool for only a buck if i had a guess if i would have got this say at target or something i would say it's probably at least five bucks i would say five bucks and i'm sure there's a date on here somewhere but i did not look for that which is bad jenny bad 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 but there's no date so i guess i wasn't bad and the last thing pretty much to go with that is some betty crocker writing icing you get purple teal white and pink it is 2.7 ounce and there you go look at that pastel colors so let me rip this little booger open and let's see i pretty much know what the tubes look like but i just like to open this items to show you 
um, what you get. So these are the ones you get. So how cool is that? You can have your little one make a, a birthday cake for someone or just because or just help you in the kitchen. Um, that's what I'm going to let my kids do. I'm going to have them make maybe some cupcakes or a cake, brownies or whatever, and decorate on what they want it to look like. So that, my subby friends, is everything that I bought at my Dollar Tree. So I hope I was able to show you something that maybe you can go find at one of your local stores. So I'm going to do a couple of Q&As right here um, by Jane Doe. Uh, would you please consider doing the drive through food, food challenge with your kids and hubby? I think I watched a video of that. Isn't that when you go through the drive through and you order the same thing that the person in front of you ordered? I'll have to check that out. I don't know. I guess I could probably try that. I don't eat out much, but maybe that'll give an excuse to go out and eat. So I just might have to do that. And the other question is by R. Kratt. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. Have you ever considered coming up with merchandise to sell like shirts or reusable bags, which is a great idea for the reusable bags, um, with your trademark saying? It kind of crossed my mind a while back. Um, actually, I had a, a company contact me in regards of merchandise and everything, which I got to look more into it. Um, but that is a good question. I might at some point, if there's a demand out there, if people would like stuff like that. Um, I know I have a, a few sayings, but my favorite one is keep smiling. The other one is jot, jot, you rock. Um, I say that a lot. Um, I also say like Jenny's world. Uh, interesting. I say that a lot, but most likely I'll probably maybe get something. Maybe that'll say, keep smiling. Um, I would love to hear your guys' input on that question. Um, should I? If I do, what kind of items would you like um, for me to have, to have a saying? And what saying is your favorite that I say? Um, I know I make up a lot of words in Jenny's world in my vocab, um, but keep smiling is my trademark, I guess, and jot, jot, you rock. So, very good question. So, those are going to be the two questions I answer here. I also wanted to add really, really quick. I had a gift card um, to Cracker Barrel that my husband got me for Mother's Day. And I took my two little ones there for lunch earlier in the week. And we were sitting there, and, you know, a lot of older people go there, which, you know, I love Cracker Barrel. I really do. Um, because I rarely go out to eat, but that is one place I really like to go out to. So I thought I would spend the day with my two little ones. We're sitting there eating, and I see this elderly woman a few rows over all by herself. Um, she was, you know, eating her lunch, drinking her pop. There was no phone, no magazine, no, no, she was just sitting there by herself. And just something hit me, and I'm like, Ugh. You know, I want to do something for her. So I flagged down my waitress and I asked her, I said, if the lady over there does not have her check yet, could you please give it to me? I would like to buy her lunch today. So luckily they did not give her her bill yet. And I went ahead and took that and took care of it. And once I was getting up, her waitress came over there to tell her that someone did take care of her lunch, that she didn't have to pay, and I took care of the tip as well. So it just made me feel really good knowing that I did my good deed um, for the day. It's very easy to do. You don't. It doesn't even have to. Um, you know, you don't have to spend money to help someone or make someone feel special. A simple hi, a smile, um, thank you, open the door for someone. Very very simple. Pay a compliment to someone. So, say that you liked their cologne or perfume or their hair looks pretty or their makeup looks nice or their dress or their shoes. Something. If you could do that every day, something very small and simple, I think this world would be such a better place to live in. So that is going to be the end of my video. So I hope you all enjoyed. If so, I would love a thumbs up. Be sure you click on to that subscribe button if you haven't already because I would really love to have you as a subby friend. I thank you all for spending the time with me today. So I hope you have a wonderful, beautiful day. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Keep smiling. Bye.
Okay, I have Alex here and he is going to be drawing one lucky winner and today I'm giving away all of these new items from the Dollar Tree. Also, before I forget, Joanne Perez, if you are watching, could you please email me your address so I can get your package out to you? So Alex, go ahead, turn around. The winner has 48 hours to contact me to claim your prize. All right, bud. And today's winner is Shannon. Shannon, congratulations. You are the winner for all these wonderful items. Once again, as always, we all appreciate your love, support, and your lovely smiley meal. So I hope you have a wonderful, beautiful Sunday, and we will see you in our next video. Bye. Bye, guys. Keep smiling.